Hi Vixens, John here. I'm um, just recording a little video today um, on the subject of how we talk about ourselves. Um, Danielle did a post on this a couple of days ago, but it's something we talk about a lot at the studio and it's something that's really important, so I thought it would be good a good subject to do a, a little video of. Because as British people, we do have a tendency to, um, well firstly to put ourselves down, but we also, we struggle to accept compliments and we also make self-deprecating jokes all the time. And although there is a place for self-deprecation because it can be funny and it also shows humility, um, those things should never come at the expense of our self-esteem and self-worth. So by always joking about ourselves and putting ourselves down, it can actually have a damaging effect on our self-esteem. I'm sure probably everyone in the group um, can, can relate to this, but there's often something that somebody's said to us in our past, and it may be um, a sibling, it may be a partner or an ex-partner, or it might even be your parents. And they've said something to you that basically has, has kind of put you down or made you feel bad about something, and you never forget it. And it kind of travels with you throughout your life. And, and in some ways it becomes a belief about yourself. And it's important that we challenge these and change the way that we think and talk about ourselves so that we are not being kind of dragged down by some negativity that's come to us in the past and we build ourselves up by the way we talk about ourselves. Because the way we talk about ourselves does have a lasting impact on our self-esteem, our self-worth and us as people. So today I have two challenges for you Vixens. The first one is that next time you see your reflection in a mirror I want you to say something positive about yourself. So instead of saying, for example, I don't like my smile, say, I look really happy. Something like that. Find something positive to say about yourself when you see yourself in the mirror. And the second challenge, this is really easy. The next time somebody pays you a compliment, I want you just to say, thank you. Now, it's not difficult to do, but I bet a lot of people in this group, and I know that I am guilty of doing this, um, when someone pays you a compliment, you'll say something like, you need your eyes testing. And it's, it's self-deprecating and it can be funny, but actually all you need to do is say thank you because that person has paid you a compliment and they mean it. If they've said, I like your dress, your hair looks lovely today, you look very nice, just say thank you. It's easy, just accept the compliment because um, that's what it was That's what it was given for. Okay, so two challenges. Let me know how you get on. Um, use the comments thread and um, I hope this video helps in some way um, and I'd love to see uh, whether you actually do the challenges that have been set. All right, take care. Bye-bye.